Hey guys, what's going on? So today we are doing this shop test again, but instead of mainly focusing on covenant bookmarks, we're going to be looking for gear as well. Mostly rings and necklaces. I'll probably check the boots as well. So on my last video, I was only looking for covenant bookmarks and just glancing over and skipping everything else pretty much unless it was like a red piece of gear. And a lot of you guys were like, well, you should check even blue and green level 85. I think someone even said I should check the gray. And, and I probably will still check the gray gear, but Why like, you test your luck? unless it's like completely perfect on the right set and the right main stat, I'm probably not going to pick it up. Um, just because gray is like horrible, maybe not stat wise, but it's just so ugly. Tier 85 gray gear, I believe is still better than some of the stuff I have on some of my... Uh, heroes. I mean, we have a purple 31 on my Destina, so probably a gray 85 would be better, actually. But it would need to be on the health set with health. Oh, that's not even health percentage. Jesus Christ. But like, this is actually not bad. You know, we got 40% health. As far as I've heard, gray 85 will get you to 50% health. I'm not too sure about that, but um, if that's the case, it would even be better than this one, technically. Although, we have 20% effect resistance here, which is... Very important for Destina since she has my front line and gets CC'd a lot. But I digress. Today, we are going to be spending those 951 crystals again, but more focusing on accessories. I did try and defend myself, but at the end of the day, you guys do have a point. We will take a look at our current bookmarks even though we have 1094, so, you know, I'm of course I'm going to be grabbing the bookmarks as well, but uh, so let's get started. I'm not going to be focusing on normal armor, especially not green. I guess I'll check it if it's at least purple or red, but these things are much more common, much easier to get. Boots aren't super hard either, but I think they're still worth checking because getting the right main stat on boots is much harder since those come with a, always the same main stat. Let's get started. So like here's an 85 blue on the crit set, which is pretty good. But then, you know, we can only see effectiveness and effect resistance. It's also 800k gold, which is very expensive. And I could potentially craft something better than that in the uh, sanctuary, so. Got some bookmarks pretty fast, that's cool. So like, these boots definitely aren't bad. They have speed, main stat, I believe that will go up to... 30 or so. Uh, but then we basically get no substats, completely random, not non-leveled up at all. So, so we have these boots, they are 71 plus 13. So 71 epic boots gets us up to 35 speed. So these might be a decent placeholder, but considering I don't know any of the stats or anything, I'm gonna skip them. Here we have an 85 blue ring, but effect resistance as its main stat and on the defensive set is completely uninteresting for me. I've also heard level 85 stuff takes 50k to remove and in the instances where effect resistance would be really nice, on a main stat, I don't know, but it would probably have to get switched around a lot and 50k is just way too much to be swapping that around. Also, it would cost me almost a million gold. Bookmarks. 85 green boots on the speed set, which is good, but flat health, so I'm not interested in that. Here we have level 70 epic boots with attack percent, but the substats aren't super great, even though I think they are a pretty decent pair of boots. So they would be a bit better than Lorena's currently, but she is on the lifesteal and crit set, so they could definitely replace Sez's though, that's for sure. He has 42 purple boots, and um... Yeah, the subsets are probably even better on those. So yeah, we'll we'll pick them up even though I'm not too happy about it. Like, I'm not super excited, but uh, I think they are pretty decent boots. Well, it actually has been a while since I checked to see if I would have anything better. Like, we have these 71s. I could put those on Lorena already, actually. Got those recently from Abyss. Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't have anything from the attack set. Okay, we'll pick those up, but we're not going for boots anymore after this. That's probably like the only boot I'll need for now. And I am aware you can craft boots in the sanctuary, but even so, getting the right main stat on Epic still will be an RNG fest, so. Here we got an 85 green necklace on the defense set with flat defense. If it was defense percent, perhaps I could give it to a defense focused tank, but in this case, I'm probably gonna skip it. Here we got an 85 green ring on crit damage set with defense percent, which kind of conflicts, so gonna skip that. Here we got an 85 green necklace on the speed set with crit chance, and the first subset we can see is speed. That one's actually pretty good. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna buy that one. Here we got a 70 purple ring on the attack set with attack subs. The substats aren't very good though. 
and I don't know. I'd probably rather wait for an 85. I'm not too sure since this number change stuff happened, to be honest, but I think this is still kind of considered T5, but on purple, which was like, I don't know, it's weird. But I believe that 10% attack should still go to 50% attack, which is uh, better than most rings I have, I, I, I would say. It's just I think only says would really benefit from that. He has 40% attack here on his ring, but then he does have, you know, 8 crit chance, 7 crit damage. Oh, and this is on the critical set, so I'd have to swap some other things around probs. I don't know if I really want to do that right now. If I find a good attack set necklace with crit chance, though... I would probably switch that out because it's only 57. Well, I don't really want to run out of gold since we still have 792 crystals to go through, so I think I'm going to have to be a little bit more picky. A purple 70 ring, effect resistance on the health set with speed, attack, and defense. I'd really consider giving that to my Destina. Even with pretty bad gear, she's sitting at, you know, 16.7k health. Oh no, I can't replace a ring. That ring is too good for now. I would definitely replace the necklace though. Here we have an 85 blue necklace, crit chance 10. I think that would go up to 50, which is quite a lot. But, I mean, we do have attack percent as well. I'm just not too familiar with the counter set. Like, who it would be good for? I haven't heard many mention of the counter set, so I kind of assume it's not that great. But we did find some covenant bookmarks. 85 rare necklace on the defense set with health percent. That's not... Bad. It's just I never use the defense set, so eh. I'll be a bit less picky once we're down to like 4,500 or so, but for now I'm gonna skip it. More bookmarks. Health set ring with flat health. Uh, definitely not good enough to replace Destina's current ring. I said I wouldn't go for gray stuff anyway. Alright, down to under 4,500. Oh, here we, uh, well, no. Damage set with flat health, shame. Counter set with flat attack, counter set with flat defense, no good. Life steal with flat health, no. Effect resist set with crit chance, eh. And attack percent as its stat, damn. I just don't think I can justify giving a set for effect resistance, it just seems a little bit too niche. Defense set with health percent, again it's the ring. If this was a necklace I would have picked it up probably and then just swapped something else on Destina for another defense to have a defense set. Uh, because it is health percentage and she has currently flat health. Plus gear is incredibly expensive to raise. Also, ooh, here we have a blue speed set necklace. What is the main stat though? Please be something good. Boom. Critical hit damage. So, I don't know about that. I don't think that's super good because as far as I know, the only way to get a ton of crit rate is on the necklace. I don't think you can get crit rate on boots or rings and for sure not the other stuff besides substats. So, man, so close. Just crit rate. Come on. It's just I don't see myself having a super high crit rate without having the main stat on the necklace of whoever I'm trying to get the high crit rate on. So crit damage doesn't really seem to make much sense. It could maybe be useful if I get super lucky with a ton of the like all the other gear and their substats and could have a decently high crit rate and then this would be like I think 60% crit damage. Would need way too much good luck in every other department. Ooh, 85 purple crit chance set, please. Please be a good main stat. Kaboom! I mean, it is effectiveness and not effect resistance, which, I mean, effectiveness, but like, that's, like, who could that be really good for? Usually with effectiveness, the one you want a ton of effectiveness on is like the debuffers and stuff, so when they're hitting their elemental weakness, they can still maybe land it. And usually those don't also deal a ton of damage. Maybe someone like Sid? Perhaps. Yeah, he only has 21% effectiveness right now. And let's check out his ring. It's on the speed set, but it is plus 15. Eek, it's only 45. Yeah, I don't know if I would want to give up 40% attack for some effectiveness. Then we have like Sez also would have to give up 40% attack and that crit chance and damage. Again, with Lorena, would have to give up the attack percent. 16% crit chance. Clary doesn't need any more effectiveness. She's at 71% already. Does she actually need effectiveness? I don't know if she actually debuffs anyone. And it's 1.1 million gold, you know? Ah, damn. Speed, crit damage, health, flat health. Like, the substance aren't even really horrible, but... Mmm, that hurts. That really hurts. It was a hard decision, but I just don't know. I just don't know what I would really do with it. More bookmarks, though. 85 crit chance necklace. 
Second time's the charm. It's only green, but still. I would take it if that's a good main stat. Ugh, that doesn't work. Well, since we're down to like 279 crystals, they were probably going to be checking uh, like blue boots as well. But that's no good. Effectiveness, blue gym with effect resistance. Uh, uh, I just skipped an 85 green speed set necklace. Damn it. Chances are I would have had a bad substat anyway. Speed set health. Oh, well, no, it's only 70. Guess we could also check the gray 85 rings. That's no good. Crit damage and effectiveness. No. Resist and health percent. Crit chance necklace, but on the defense set, so probably no. More bookmarks. Here we got a green 85 necklace on the speed set. Good, good, good main stat, please. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, wait. Yeah, well, I did hear Destina could be pretty good with a speed set. Mine is so freaking slow. And, you know, so that necklace by itself would be better, you know, than her current one. Even if it took off the 15% health and I maxed out that one I would grab from the shop, she would probably still have overall more health. Like this helmet is way too good. 22% health down there. I could probably replace the armor and the weapon, of course, but I wouldn't want to replace the boots or the ring unless I find speed set boots with health percent or a speed set ring with health percent like this dude. That's actually not a bad ring. I believe we got this from some kind of event. Wonder why I don't equip it on anyone. Hey, well, I'm gonna grab that because we're getting low on crystals anyway, and I could really consider giving Destina a speed set since she is so tanky anyway. It's just that in some content, she never gets a chance to attack because she's so damn slow. It's not super expensive either, so let's go, let's go ahead and I'll decide later if I'm gonna actually do that or not though. And ultimately, she wouldn't have that much less HP anyway. I don't think I wanna mess with RNG that much and kind of need to get all my crit chance from substats. Yeah, but I'll be getting an almost as good one, maybe even slightly better because I think it comes with attack percent when I go a little bit further in, in Abyss. Might be actually on that floor already. More bookmarks, more bookmarks. I wonder if we're gonna get 50 again like we did last time. 85 gray necklace, crit set, but with health percent, so no. Five more refreshes, nothing. All right, so, so I believe we picked these up, yeah. Um, you know, level 70, attack set, attack percent. I was gonna replace Sez's with those. They are significantly better, I believe. Uh, substats, you know, besides speed, aren't super good. Maybe a little bit of defense in there wouldn't be bad. We didn't pick up any rings, it looks like. So, speed set with health percent. I was thinking about giving that to Destina along with the rest of a speed set. And here we got a speed set with crit chance and speed substat down there. Uh, that's effect resistance. It's also not bad. So, you know, all in all, I think it was okay. You know, eh, three gears. That maybe can boost me a little bit, but um, I think we had 1,094 and now we have 1,144. So indeed we got 50 bookmarks again. I'm not sure if that's uh, just set like that. Could be of course coincidence, but I've been recording here for almost an hour now. So um, yeah, going through the shop takes a lot longer when you're looking at everything instead of just covenant bookmarks. Obviously, there was one 85 necklace I accidentally skipped, but I can assure you that was the only one. And that was because I got distracted by the 85 thing right above it and didn't think to look down one more. But um, yeah, so if you're hard pressed for gear, need some decent artifacts, even 85 green ones like you guys said are pretty good. Uh, the main stat does go, I think, as high as epic ones do. It's just the substats, of course, are going to be all lower. But I think the main stat, since it does go up to like 50% for most stats, is still very good and by far the most important thing. But yeah, that'll wrap it up for this video. Make sure to tell me what you think in the comments down below. Probably there were some things I skipped that you do not agree with. That is okay. You can drop them down there as well. It's just I wanted to spend my gold wisely in case I came across like a perfect thing that was just like very expensive and I didn't want to be out of gold at that, at that point so I was a little bit more picky than maybe I should have been. Whatever happens. But yeah that'll do it for today's video. Dropping a like if you happen to enjoy is always greatly appreciated as well. Thanks as always for watching and until next time.